Lego guys, today I'm going to be sharing with you my comments on the recent news about uh, a Lego Kuso project that has just achieved 10,000 supporters. Now, if you've read the title of this post, uh, you've already known that it's the Big Bang Theory project. Now, this is the first time I do this, and I kind of wished I did it on past. Um, projects that have hit 10,000 supporters for example the uh, back to the future one and um, the Lego Minecraft one different ones like that um, but I'm going to start doing this more when new projects uh, hit 10,000 uh, supporters but I'm not going to do it on all of them just the ones that um, uh, sort of catch my eyes more um, that interest me much more so yeah so it's going to be on the Lego Big Bang Theory project. So, uh, the Big Bang Theory is probably my favorite all-time TV show. I love the show. So, right here, as you can see, is the project page on l the Lego Kuso website. So, it's achieved. Um, I think the design looks amazing. I think the minifigures are just so well done. I love how they did Sheldon's shirt, the Flash shirt. It's a classic. Um, Howard looks so good. And Leonard with his jacket. Just really good. I just love how they did all the characters. And they also did the heights. They made uh, Sheldon's legs higher. And yeah, different heights. But if Lego makes it, I don't think they'll make different heights. It'll probably just be all... Uh, regular minifigure sized. Um, now, I really, really like the design of the whole apartment, how they put all the different nerdy aspects. One thing that I found really funny is they even have the Rubik's Cube uh, Kleenex box on the tail, which I found was really funny. And they have plenty of really cool details, like Sheldon's uh, whiteboard, um, telescope, globe. Green Lantern's lamp, um, a sort of figurines on the shelf, the desk with the computer, and the carpet and the couches is just really, really well done. Um, looks exactly like in the show. Now, uh, I would just like to talk a bit about right here. Uh, first is another version, as you can see. Uh, so yeah, uh, so I would just like to give my thoughts on whether I think this will. Uh, pass and Lego will make it or not. Sadly, I as much as I would love to see, I, I it would be amazing to me to have this as a set. I just love the Big Bang Theory, and it would be so cool to have a Big Bang Theory Lego set. But as much as I want to, um, I don't necessarily think it's going to pass because, first of all, um, in th in the past Lego has done a lot of more. Uh, sets for older uh, people, teenagers, and uh, adults, uh, adults. Um, even uh, the Back to the Future sets, I don't think there are a lot of young kids that necessarily know about the movie. And also they've done Lego themes uh, really more for older kids, teenagers, and adults. Um, like just a superhero theme like some superhero movies are just really dark for kids to watch um so yeah um so yeah lego has done sets for older people and also like really big sets with lots of pieces so we know they've done that in the past but the big bang theory show really is not for young kids at all uh the subjects and themes uh in that show is really more for it uh, really targeted for teenagers and uh adults so i don't think on that aspect it's going to pass um and i mean it's really more of a set to display i mean i don't think there's going to be as much play features um as for example the minecraft set but um 
yeah. So those are the reasons why I don't think it's going to pass, but I think it would be really, really cool if LEGO made it pass. If it were up to me, I would uh, make LEGO <laughs> do this project because it would be so cool to have this set. Uh, so yeah, those are my thoughts on this set. Um, again, I would really love to see this as a set, um, but for different reasons... Uh, it may not pass, but a thing that surprised me is that Lego has made a Simpsons set, and The Simpsons isn't necessarily a show for young kids either. I mean, some jokes are pretty crude in that show, so again, maybe Lego uh, will pass it, because like I said, um, Lego has made uh, Lego sets for older um, people, so, when I say older people, it sounds like elderly people, but when I say older people, I just mean teenagers and adults, so, yeah, again, Lao, I'm just going to go on the LEGO website just to kind of refresh uh, my memory a bit on a few themes that are really more targeted for um, the older audience, obviously, like, the city themes and themes like that, aren't uh, just for they're really more for kids but e some creator sets the really like big modular ones those are definitely for like uh, older uh, people older fans the superhero sets too the Hobbit and Lord of the Rings is also targeted for older uh, the older audience obviously of Lego uh, so yeah uh, oh yeah also Technic um, is also a lot of their sets are really harder builds um, for the older audience. So anyways, uh, back to the actual video, the Big Bang Theory uh, project. I really, really personally hope that it's going to pass and become a set. I think it would be amazing to have and display and have all the Big Bang Theory characters and mini as minifigures. That would be so cool. I would love it. Uh, but again, like I said, there's a good possibility that it will pass too because it's r a really original idea and different from anything LEGO has made. So yeah, maybe it'll pass too. So those are my thoughts on the Big Bang Theory Kuzo project. I hope you enjoyed this video. And please don't forget to share this post and follow my blog. And thank you all for watching.